Hicksfield AI have just released a new tool called Canvas and this has blown away all competition when it comes to AI image editing, especially when it comes to product placement because now you can add or replace or modify anything in an existing image with a single click. For example, if I wanna replace the perfume bottle in this particular shot, all I do is I upload my own image of the perfume bottle and the job is done. Then let's say I wanna change over the jacket to my own jacket. Again, with a single click, you can do that. Not only can it replace the objects in the scene, you can also add things which were never there. For example, in this image, if I want her to hold this particular purse, Again, I can do this with a single click. It also comes with flux context prompting, therefore you can modify those images further in any way that you want. So in the earlier image, if I also wanted the background to be white, I can just type in a simple prompt and the background becomes white. If I wanna remove the text in this particular image, I can do that also using the flux context feature. So this combines everything into one place. So let's see quickly how this works. So first of all, you're gonna go over to hicksfield.ai, then you're gonna go over to this canvas feature. The link is given in the description, as well as the links to all the images that we will be using have been given in the description so you can follow along. You will see this interface and the first thing we will do is we're gonna upload our image here, so let's do that. Now that the image has been uploaded, it's a very simple task. For example, right now I wanna replace this perfume bottle. All I have to do is by default, you have this mask brush with you. You can just brush over this area and upload the photograph of your own perfume bottle here. And you can just type in a simple prompt which says change the perfume bottle. No need for complex prompting at all. It only takes one credit. And when I, when I hit generate, I'm gonna get four variations and it usually gives out very consistent results right in the first go. So let's wait for this. And just like that, within 10 seconds, we've got our result and you can see that this looks absolutely amazing. Let's see the different variations. The consistency looks great and nothing else changed in the shot. But why stop here? We can build on any of the edits that we like. So right now what I can do is get rid of this, put the image of the red leather jacket. Once the image is here, all we need to do is just quickly brush over the areas that will be replaced. So let me finish over by brushing over the entire black blazer. Once this is done, I can just type in a simple prompt, change the black blazer to the red jacket, hit generate and let's just wait for the results. All right, and our results are ready. Let's have a look at this. And you can see it's exactly that same jacket. The only thing is the pose has changed a bit. That can happen if the area that you're brushing over is very large, but overall her face hasn't changed and nothing else has changed. And in a lot of results that I got like this, even the pose was very similar. So you can just sometimes try things again, but this is again very, very easy and convenient. The best part is that you don't have to stop here because this tool also has flux context prompting built into it. So here I can just select the first option, which is flux context. And then I can just type in a prompt to change anything else also in the image. So let's say I wanna change the background to white. I just need to type that here. And this is gonna cost three credits. Let's hit generate and let's wait for the results. And you can see that our results are ready. This is the first result. You can see everything remained consistent. And this is the second result. So how easy was that? Let's see another example. So this time we've got this image. Now we just wanna add something, not replace something that is also possible. So I'm gonna switch back to the product placement in painting option. Just, so let's say, if I just zoom in, you can do that by holding down control or command and dragging your mouse wheel. And I can just paint over this area because I want her to hold a purse here. So just the size of the purse, just keep that in mind and draw an area around her hand. I'm gonna add the photo of this particular purse. And I've written a simple prompt, which is woman holding the purse. And we're gonna hit this and let's wait for the results. All right, so our four results are ready. And let's look at these. You can see this is amazing. The consistency is great. If we just zoom in to have a look, you can see this looks perfect. And like I said, because this is along with flux context, I can go back here and edit anything in this shot. So I can say, remove the text on the wall or change the color of the wall or anything that you want because flux context is known for its consistency. So let's just wait for the results. And just like that, we have our result ready. Let's see another example. So this time we've got this image and we have our own bag that we wanna put here. It maintains the consistency even in complex products like this. So let me quickly brush over this, write the prompt, upload the image and let's see the result. All right, so I've brushed over this area, uploaded the image of our own bag and the prompt is simple, change the bag. Let's see the results. 
and our results are ready if we zoom in you can clearly see if we compare it with our bag is exactly the same bag but the compositing is just so real finally one last example now you know the drill so i'll just show you direct directly the results so this was our original image and i wanted to put both the purse that we saw before as well as these boots onto this image did exactly the same thing twice and this was the result so easy now one of the best parts is that if you have an image in which you have a person you can also use the hicks field speak feature to use lip syncing and turn it into a video where that person is talking i do plan to cover hicks field speak in one of my future videos because right now it is the best lip syncing model out there on the internet along with heygen ai which is something i've covered before but there's another thing that i want to show you before I close this video, which is if we go over to the pricing tab here, this canvas feature, if you just go down here, is available even on the nine month, $9 per month basic plan, which is amazing because if you think of it, the very fact that it has the product placement model as well as the flux context prompting available, this definitely makes it the cheapest way to access flux context along with canvas and I don't think for image editing you would need any other software because this can handle pretty much any task. So in my opinion, this is the cheapest way to get the best of both the worlds, Hicks Field and Flux Context. In case this video helped you out, do give it a like. And if you want to follow along all my experiments in the AI image and video editing world, make sure you subscribe and I will see you next time.